In order to connect your S24 Ultra to the computer, regardless if this is a Windows or Mac, you need to use your charging cable to connect on one end to the S24 Ultra and the other end to the computer. Unlock your S24 Ultra and you should see this message or something similar. Allow access to phone data. We will allow this one. And once this is done, if you have a Windows computer, open the Photos app. And inside of the Photos app, there is this Import button. So we'll tap on Import. And you can see your S24 uh, Ultra will show up. And if we tap on this, we can see all of the photos and the videos on our S24 Ultra. And then we can just move them over to our computer. So you would just select what you want to add like this. And then you click on add and that would move the photos or the videos from your phone to the computer. You also have these softwares you can download from Samsung. So the first is Samsung Flow. And on Samsung Flow, this allows you to quickly transfer files between your Samsung and your Windows. Uh, you can view the screen of your Windows computer on your Samsung. And there's other quick transfer features as well. You can even view messages on your Windows computer, which came from your Samsung. And you can download this on Windows with the Microsoft Store. There is also the Smart Switch software. So this allows you to back up your data from your Samsung computer to your computer. So uh, if we go down here, we click the download. This is the Google Play one. We want the Windows one, which you can see right here. And there is the Mac download as well. Now, if you are on a Mac, you need to get third party software to view the files. So if you search up for Android file transfer Mac, you should see the official Android website. There is this file transfer software you can get. And so if we just connect the S24 Ultra to the Mac and we unlock, and then we allow the connection from the Mac itself, we should see allow access to data, let's allow. And we got this can't access storage, just click on okay. And we just need to open that Android file transfer software. So we'll just open it again. And so this is the file system of our Samsung. We can see it here. And so if we go to, let's say DCIM camera, and here are all of the photos you can see right here and the videos as well. And all you do is you just dra uh, drag and drop this. So I'm just going to open a finder window and I'll create a new folder called videos. And so just select what you want. I'm just going to select like this. And then I'm going to drag and drop to my videos folder. And if we look here, these are the photos that have been moved over. Uh, let's do this one. Boom. And you can see this is a <laughs> picture of my dog. And you can see that's how you do that there. Samsung Smart Switch is also available on the Mac. So if you want to back up all of your files from your Samsung to the Mac, you can do that as well.